Lieutenant Delmont Walker, reporting for duty. Yo, Baird, how long is it gonna stay dark in here? Wait, dark? Where are you? Where you told me to go. Oh dear, miscommunication. Dave, uncloak. All right, can you at least see Dave? Yeah, I see Dave. All right, working on getting that module powered up. Could you just hurry? Ah, lights are glitched. Iris, open the doors. Certainly, Damon. What the hell, man? Hey, we had to get light in that box somehow, didn't we? Hang on, we'll set you down. Oh, tell me again why you got me out of my perfectly good bed for this? All right, I want to upgrade our security bots for combat against the swarm. Everything you do, the sensors on your armor will record. Man, you think your boss gonna be able to compile my moves? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. <clears throat> nice landing, Bear. Thanks. Okay, we need to calibrate those sensors to just follow Dave. Good, now keep up with them. Man, I could be having brunch right now. Your waffles will be there when we're done, kid. <laughs> Data's looking good. Dave, proceed. All right, Lieutenant. After every task, I'll update your TACCOM. Check it now. Oh, look. I see Dave. Wonderful. I, I love it. Anyway, uh, now hit the keypad. Excellent. Iris, bring in the next module. Incoming, Damon. All right. Step one for combat-ready DB is making them use and understand cover, like you would. Uh. Next piece of cover, please. All right. Now swap to the adjacent piece of cover. Perfect. We got it. Now hug that wall and move left. Pretend you're taking fire. Pew, pew, pew. Good. Data's clean. Now, let's make it more interesting. Our DB's gotta learn that enemies can still hit him in cover from an angle. Using the cover, break Dave's line of sight so they can learn how to move like a real gear. All right, I'm down. Dave, bring up your targeting laser. <laughs> Oh, you can't find me. Oh, you missed me. this module with a cover mantle. Take cover in your day. Good. So, how you feeling, kid? You know, limber enough. Iris, activate the sprinting trench. Certainly, Damon. Running at full speed while keeping your head down does not come naturally to a bot. So let's show him how it's done. Race Dave to the other end, kid. Iris, count down, please. Three, two, one, go. Good. Now race Dave back to the start. Iris. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Too slow, Dave. All right, good job. Data's clean. Just think, every time it sprints, it'll have your distinctive gait. Lucky them. What's next? Iris, ready for the shooting module. <sighs> Finally. Shooting module has been placed. 
Okay, grab a Lancer, the COG's most trusted and versatile firearm. Man, how could you not trust something with a chainsaw bayonet? All right, kid, incoming Guardians. Take down their shields and destroy them. DB Guardian online. Okay, now aim down your sights. DBs love to hip fire. We need to change that. You know how to fire a gun, man. Now let's try using blind fire to destroy them while keeping yourself protected in cover. Unit operational. <laughs> now that is good thing. Put that in your thing. For some goddamn reason, Davies have trouble nailing a perfect reload. Show them how it's done. Oh, perfect. That's gotta be solid data there. Not bad, not bad. But let's up the challenge. Can you take down a moving target? Unit online. Citizen, all the items. Easy peasy. Good. Let's move on to explosives training, shall we? Grab some frag grenades from the rack. You sure you want DBs tossing frags around? Uh, have you met the swarm? All right, now equip it. Iris, bring in some volunteers for Lieutenant Walker to blow up. Yes, dear. Er, Damon. Yes, Damon. Ah, uh, you didn't hear that. Uh, uh, Baird, how does blowing up DBs help train them? They're old custodial units. I was gonna strip them for parts anyway. Okay, just like when shooting, keep your head down and blind toss the grenade. Unit operational. I'm here to help. Boom! Put my eyes closed! Great! Now open your eyes and target the rest. Just wind up, aim, and release. Grab more frags if you run out. That's one! Terrific. This module's almost complete. You ready for a live fire exercise? <laughs> Does Marcus like tomatoes? An emphatic yes. Grab some fresh ammo and frags, then get back into cover. Shepard DBs are using shock rounds. Take them out. No problem. Aim for the head. They'll go down quicker. Quick is good. Start. You try mixing things up between firepower and explosives. I use the same thing. Prepare for detainment. Excellent work. Data looks good. Ready to move on? Sure. Why not? Great. Now for a quick exercise in field medicine. Iris, bring in the patient. He is joining us now. What's wrong with him? Looks fine to me. Dave? What a pleasant day we're having. Having Having eat. Help him up, Del. You know, for science. I got you. I got you. Your assistance is most appreciated. Now, word of warning. This next one's gonna sting a bit. What are you talking about? Dave? DB, <laughs> help him up. Damon, this is not part of the training protocol. Are you instead having fun with Lieutenant Walker? Iris. Ignore her, kid. She's uh, on the fritz or something. Citizen, it appears you need aid. Ah, oh, oh, you're a real dick, Baird. Hey, kid, do me a favor and scrap that custodial unit for me. Just use your Lancer's chainsaw. Really? Damn, man, that's cold. Might as well. Brunch is over anyway. That's the spirit. Iris, initiate the next training module. Preparing now, Damon. 
Grab a Nash or shotgun off the rack. Ooh, I already know I'm gonna like this. Come on. Clear out those shepherds. Need as much close quarters data as I can get. Watch me work, baby. You that Nash is made for close range combat, kids. So feel free to get in their faces. Citizen, prepare for detainment. Yes! Concern for citizen safety deactivated. Boom! Concern for citizen safety. Hey, you like that? I know I do. Concern for citizen safety deactivated. And done. Good work. Oh, and Iris, we're gonna need cleanup in module seven. Anyway, ready for the hand-to-hand -hand module? Oh, when you're born ready, you ain't got to get ready. Uh, yeah. Just follow Dave. Welcome to the hand-to-hand -hand combat module. First up, use your combat knife to take out the deactivated DB. That seems a little unfair, but okay. Concern versus... While it's down, let's grab some finishing move data. Impressive! Excessive, but impressive. All right, coming up next, some in-cover Let's do it. Okay, take cover behind the next shepherd. Concern versus and safety deactivated. Now give it a yank and insert knife. Almost feel sorry for him. Hey, with learning comes sacrifice. Same drill. Get into cover opposite the shepherd, but this time mantle into them. Line it up and insert knife. And I'm sensing it happen. Okay, now let's see the counter. Get into cover. He's coming for you. Counter him. Come here, you. Excellent. Now put him down. There, this is mechanical slaughter, man. Oh, really? Well, what do you say we grab some data from a fair fight? Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. You don't have enough robots to make this a fair fight. Oh, yeah? We'll see. Gear up and we'll get started. Iris, initiate combat simulation 12. Damon, combat simulation 12 will provide a gear as skilled as Lieutenant Walker with minimal challenge. Iris, I knew I loved you. Okay, simulation 13. Higher challenge, better results. Worst case, Dell's in the hospital for like a week or two. Wait, ho hospital what now? Oh, you'll see. Just get to Dave and we'll get started. Teammates, kid. Hi, teammates. Greetings, Lieutenant. Iris, bring in their opponents. The incoming enemy units won't be holding back, so get me data I can work with. Let's go, fellas! Team Dell all the way! Engaging! Unit requires assistance. Targets identified. Ah! Reloading the shield.
all you got, because I got more to teach. Nice work. Once these upgrades are in, the swarm's in for a nasty surprise. Hope you got what you needed. I'm gonna go eat. I will begin analyzing the data shortly. Iris, what would I do without you? I shudder to think, Damon. Previously on Gears. We used to protect Cox settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? The short version? The cop is on his way. You promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with the fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. <laughs> Look, you know as well as I do that he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Dad, you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? I thought you said you weren't running from a car. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. We need to get through that fort to the abandoned Osborne mine on the other side. A car dumped a few thousand locust bodies in there after the war. If your swarm's related to the grubs, we'll find out there. I guess we're all alone out here. We definitely found where they're coming from. And where those snatchers are going. My dad's alive and he's down there.
is not ready for this. She can barely keep her eyes open. Don't worry about her. She'll be ready. Okay, we're almost at Bear's coordinates. Welcome to Azura. When's the last time you slept? Last night. Got a good eight or nine minutes in. Nightmares? Does it get better? It gets tolerable. See what we got. Come on, time to hook in for the drop. So who's jumping first? Definitely not you. Del, I'm fine, okay? Sure you are. Oh, shit. Thanks, Del. Sam, we're out going. Roger that. We're standing by up here. See you soon. Hey, hey, you coming? Control, we're going in. Control? Really? I have a name. <laughs> control. Regs are regs, Bear. I mean, Control. And we're already breaking enough of them as it is. What Jin doesn't know won't hurt her. This is my call, all right? If the First Minister doesn't like it, she can yell at me. Which she almost certainly will. Just tell us where to go, Control. I'll do my best. But remember, no one's been in that facility for like 25 years. Yeah, that's... Pretty evident. You're not there to buy a timeshare. You're there to watch an old hammer of dawn prototype. And your intel says one of the silos is still intact, right? Yeah, as far as they can tell. Just get Dave to a functional control room. He'll handle the launch sequence. Loke's burial site in this island. We're hatched, we're gonna be waist deep in swarm. This is one hell of a way to come back to Azura. Yeah, but we get those satellites up, we can fry the swarm from orbit. Hey, 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 get back! Oh shit! What the hell? Uh, I need to search a place that's falling apart. Quickly. Bear's plan to launch a satellite from here? It seems a little half-baked. Well, half-baked plans are kind of Baird's specialty. How Baird even figured out they had a hammer satellite here? My father. Before he died, he let Baird in on a few cock secrets. And this island has plenty of them.
Huh. Didn't expect there'd still be bodies. <laughs> Only a handful of us made it off the shore. Okay, let's go. Hey, back! We're coming down! Huh, guess who? Dave, send a pulse and let's see what we're dealing with. Ah, there they are. For now, Delta out. Come on, we're gonna find one of those silos. Assuming the swarm haven't ripped them all apart. Hey, I think we can get down this way. Asylum. For the record, you don't seem okay. I'll live. There's too many active hives. Everywhere we go, another burial site's hatched. All the more reason to get the hammer going alive. Let's hope Jin sees it that way. hammer satellite up, we can do it again. That's the idea, old pal. Control out.
So, straight's not an option. How much rocket base is even left? Let's find out. You guys go right, Marcus and I will go left. We'll find those silos. Sounds good. Stay in contact. You sure about this? Two silos, two paths. You got a better idea? some kind of an exhaust tunnel. But is it from a silo? Only one way to find out. Looks like this sluice gate's our way out. Dave, can you get this open? Man, you know what? If they want to turn this place into a hive, let them. It's an isolated island hundreds of miles from shore. Uh-huh. Let's just make sure that happens after we leave. <laughs> See? Dave gets it. Okay, let's find that silo. Going down. So much for a silo. Yeah, under here. Oh, man, we got company. James, we're above you. I see you. Neutralized. 
few more up here. You two push ahead. Copy that. Watch it, swarm! Shit, carrier! Drone, we can use those reinforcements right about now! The Condor's almost within range, Delta. Okay, kid, reinforcements incoming. I've got Guardians or DR-1. What do you want? Shut down Guardians! You got it! Carriers down. Thanks for the help. DBs, one of you secure the area. The other's with us. Let's go. Acknowledge. Nope, locked. We'll have to find another way to open it. A door. He's doing a lot more than that. Well, either way, the door's open. Thanks, Dave. So, that data Dave just downloaded? There's a big hole at the highest security clearance. How does this relate to our mission? It doesn't, but now I need to know. I'm guessing whatever's missing was pulled from the network. Well, who'd have the authority to do that? Back then, uh, only the facility commander. Find his office, poke around. Okay, we'll go. Scanning immediate area. Detecting all inferior bomb technology. <laughs> oh, come on now. That's just me. that office. There. Done. 
Now let's find that office. So, Jared wants lost data, huh? What does it even look like? Well, I mean, if it got pulled from the network, it probably got stored on some kind of external drive. No, Commander's office is through here. This door is locked. All right, Commander's office. Let's look around. Dave, get this open. Gotcha. Hey, Control. Good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all over us. Oh, shit. We're on our way. Is that rocket attack? It is, believe it or not. Good. Then find a port for Dave to plug into. If it checks out, he'll initiate the launch. It's all yours. Control, you're in. Start the launch sequence. Pressurized. First stage. Opening silo doors. Error. Error. Uh, Delta, Error. we have an issue. The silo hatch. It's not opening. Oh, of course. I knew that seemed too easy. Baird, options. Bug out. Blast doors aren't going to protect you from an exploding rocket. All right, then we call it. Let's go. Hydraulic external power to on. No. We get that hatch open. What? Kid, listen to your old man. You got to get out of there. Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition test commence. We got the swarm! Dave, with me! Ignition, engine one. God damn it, James! I have got to learn to stop following you. Yeah, good luck with that. Well, let's get that hatch open. So what's our plan?
Ready for extraction. James, how about I see Jen first? I'll calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix being diplomatic? You can call it what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary, and you know it. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay, um, yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Come on, Dave. That was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. Yeah, um, I'm sorry. The thing is, you two are more alike than either of you want to admit. The data is in front of you, Damon. What? what? That's it? I thought the new satellite would automatically link to the old ones. It cannot find them. Without regular scheduling from telecommand, tracking accuracy degrades. <sighs> Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your word's literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually thanking me. Please stop me. talking. So, I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, that data drive you wanted. Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Ah. Uh, What's wrong with Dave? Dave had a few problems. What kind of problems? Hmm. Uh, that kind. Oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. <sighs> Everyone. 
Meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's different about him? All new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Uh-huh. And... And he's... all yours. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Damon, there are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. More sarcasm to add to your growing library. Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. Did I succeed? <sighs> Follow me. You'll want to equip this new module ASAP. It'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna dig this. It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Over here. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. I'll put this to good use. Activate Alpha 331. Certainly, Dan. So, say you've got a target that seems awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate it. See what happens. Unit reloading. Jack, flash! All right, finish it. Test sequence complete. Huh. That could be useful. Now, let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. targets. Reload initiated. Flash! Commencing reload. But, uh, Jack's my new best friend. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. What Damon means to say is that he has more important things to do. Thank you, Iris. Bluntness is one of Iris's more commendable traits. Wonder where she gets that from. Whoa, that smells less than great. So, Baird, I know you were kind of mad when Jin shoved you in here. How do you like it? Oh, I, I'm enjoying it. The workshop's quiet, peaceful. Damon is not being truthful. Shortly before you arrived, he was highly critical of the First Minister, referring to her several times as... Let's a... not get into specifics, Iris. Also, why did you tell him that? I detected genuine personal concern for you in Corporal Diaz's intonation. 
I thus judged it appropriate to inform her how you truly feel. Who? Inappropriate sarcasm. Incompetent nurturing instincts. Iris, are you sure you're not secretly my mother? So close to getting the hammer fully operational again. Huh, Mega Mech. Really saved our asses last time. Damon, you'll be pleased to learn I've located one of the missing satellites. Iris, great news, where? At the bottom of the Garaznian Sea, approximately 15 miles from shore. Oh. Apparently it fell from orbit. <laughs> Your deductive powers are truly impressive, Iris. And you, Damon, are quite handsome. I intended that remark to be sarcastic. Yeah, I figured. To have them on our side again. Does Sam get down here much? You know, uh, when she can. Damon and Miss Byrne are currently experiencing relationship difficulties. My God, I've created a monster. Oh well, Iris, go ahead, explain. Miss Byrne would like to commemorate their long-running but non-marital relationship with a tattoo. Damon, however, is frightened of needles, thus the impasse. I am not frightened of needles. Damon is exceedingly frightened of needles. In fact, I would categorize his fear as classically phobic. Baird, get a tattoo for your special lady friend already. Anything else you'd like to share, Iris? Our lovemaking frequency, perhaps. I fail to see why that would be of any interest to your guests. Decorum, amazing. Later, Baird. Come on, guys. No worries. Do your thing. Come on. Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. Yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work, punching machines. And sparring. Hang on a second, shit stick. Shit stick? Del, theories? I don't know. Maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick used to stir up shit. All right, fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? <laughs> you want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is gonna leave me at a distinct disadvantage. Then again, maybe not. Hilarious. Are you in or not? Oh, I'm in. Come on, man. Let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this will be fun. Oh, son of a... How's that fun working out for you? Try it again, Foss. Come on. Here's the thing, Foss. The bottle spar with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming, but... Explain! Shit. Your false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? Nah, I'm good. Jin does love her golden boys. But never for very long. See, that was fun. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Fa's fun time's over, can we go find that component? Gotta tell you, that cheap shot? Mm. Chef's kiss, buddy. Chef's kiss. Not even noon yet. Huh. Ah, there's the component we're borrowing. Or stealing. Number 
prefer borrowing. Indefinitely. I say, I'm loving the new Jack. Can't wait to test him out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. We still have to go to Jen's office. Yeah, Dad's probably had enough alone time with her by now. Man, Foz left his locker open. <laughs> There's a stink bomb when you need one. <laughs> Never could get used to the field of you in those things. enough. You gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jen. perfectly clear when it comes to this weapon I don't share your optimism it's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism yes well I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that for both our sakes Anya would have wanted you, you don't get to talk about her if that's what you think, I won't argue. You and that goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son. And mine. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. <sighs> I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? She should be buried here, you know, with the All Fathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister, Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Send them in. Ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means, explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah. That'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Oh, we're under attack! We need immediate help! Please, slow down. Send reinforcements! Now! Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it! Go! Main gate! Keep anything else from getting inside. You realize I'm the ranking officer here, right? And we'll reinforce Carmine at the town hub. I can't believe we're back here. We did our duty. You need to get over it. Get over it? Guys, not the time. 
Cole, let's see what we're dealing with. Oh, shit! through to Carmine? Uh, no can do, kid. His radio's out. You okay? I can see him at the central hub, so he's up and fighting, but the swarm's all over him. Hurry if you can. Run our way. Come on, Delta. Let's get out of here. Settlement. Keep your convoy away from it. Oh, Delta, I was gonna do donuts around it. Be advised, Corporal. They're faster than they look. Delta out. Stay back! They're coming in! Hey! Stand down, Private! We're geared! 
Oh, shit, sorry, Lieutenant. No harm, no foul. What are you doing here? I uh, lost our DBs and we've got civilians holed up in here. Lizzie, Delta requesting civilian pickup. Sector 8, apartment complex. Copy that, Delta. I'll circle back. Thanks for that, Lieutenant. No problem, Private. Come on, Delta. Sorry again for the air and fire, Lieutenant. I'm glad you showed up when you did, sir. You guys here to pick us up? We're not, but the convoy's on the way. Thank God my kids are new at Careful out there, sir. Loco. Let's go, Delta. Which means I call in the reinforcement. Yes, sir. I, I will fix it. Oh, don't get 
get too close! They need you at the hub. Go! You can get there through the park. Gates by the steps. All right, you heard her. Let's move. Come on, through here. Down. You're gonna be okay. You know, you might not have a problem with shooting innocent people, but I do. Innocent, huh? Innocent. So people throwing firebombs are innocent. Hm. Good to know. Both of you, knock it off. Wait. I heard about this. That was you three? Not three. One of us managed to keep his DBs under control. What the hell happened? We identified an insurgent element and eliminated it. No. You opened fire on a protest. Every herd needs a good culling. I know who I'll call from this herd. Happen, happen. Right now, we focus on completing this evacuation. Goddamn right. There's the hub. Dead ahead. Shit, Carmine is definitely in trouble. Nah, it's like we gotta cross it the other side. <laughs> Swarm's taking down our condors, too. Yeah, I bet that goddamn swarm might go to jail. Every condor we lose means fewer reinforcements. Lieutenant, you are looking for the road. I'll wait further orders. Got a way through here. Snatch it. That thing makes its way to the hub. Carmine's problem is going to get a lot worse. Come on. Hey, Juvie! Take him out! I've got one thing to say! These papa things got to go!
Carmine's down. Delta, Carmine's back on comms, patching him through. Phoenix, I'm down to my last squad of TVs here. Where the hell are you? Hang on, Sarge. We're almost there. Show these DBs how it's done. Clear the plaza. Civilians safe. We'll handle things out here. Uh oh, what do we got? Oh, lance of grenade launchers. Where the hell does Brown find the time? Here, yeah, get him while they're hot. Let's make this work. Here they come. All right, Delta. Let's light them up. Division will not. 
Quick! Whatever happened to that snatcher we were following? Oh, you had that! Stay back! Fire in rage! Uh, that thing is blowing me up! Oh, hell no! Uh. It's a big ugly beast, the idiot! Ah, damn it! Come on, Big Bomber! You think it's gay? Ah! You ain't gay, behind! Target acquired. Plaza secure. Continue the evac. Copy that, Delta. We're coming out. All right, evacuees, listen up. Double time it to the Minotaurs. No personal items, no luggage. What? Death? No personal items. Carmine. Man, you kept a lot of people alive today, Sarge. Ha <laughs> ha! The grub killer retires, baby! Grub killer, swarm killer, whatever. Yeah, rescued by my old trainees. Uncle Clay! Yeah, and now I gotta get up again. Was getting worried. You didn't report back. Radio died. And these guys pulled me out of a jam. Guess I owe you twice, Phoenix. Now what? Stim our way through that fire. Okay, go, go! Oh, strong stuff. Forgot about that. Oh. Okay. Moving up. Requesting backup. 
Shut down our box? There's no way we can hold this settlement. JD, Joe, Marcus and I have to bug out of the wall. The swarm is everywhere. We can't raise control. Ugh, something's messing with our comms. Jury, Kate, we got separated from Cole, Foss, and Carmine. And we got to regroup. We need to the theater. Oh, God. See you there. JD, come on. Let's cut through the hotel. In here. Yo, Jack, give us some light. Oh, shit. We're losing a lot of gears. Phoenix, I made it back to my convoy. Gonna try to get these people out of here. Copy that, Lizzie. Good luck.
going in there, Dell. Get ready. Man, I can't believe this turned shit so fast. Okay. Cole, Vaz, Carmine. You think they're okay? I hope so. Let's get to Kate and Dad. Then we can worry about the others. Oh, shit. I'm going that way. This way. Nice and quiet. What the hell is this? Oh, my God. 
You showed up. Glad you're safe. Baird, we got him. Where do you need us? Well, at the theater, there was a group of evacuees there. Lost contact with them an hour ago. Okay, we'll round them up and get them to safety. And Baird, if anyone calls for reinforcements, don't do it. Roger that, but there's a lot already out there. Understood, Control. We'll keep an eye out. <laughs> What's his name? Uh, 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 Jace Stratton. He was in the play that's running here, right? If you're worried, don't be. Jace can handle himself. <sighs> no one back here. Let's check the stage. Okay, let's go. Damn it. Nothing. If people were here, where'd they all go? Maybe they got out. Let's get that curtain open. Let's do this! Here they come! 
Let's just... Let's just get out of here. Find the others. Hey, I think we can exit stage right. Now this will do. Evacuees didn't make it. Cole, Foz, the Carmines? What's their status? Lizzie made it back to her convoy, but she keeps getting rerouted. Clay found a Raven out, but I can't reach Cole or Foz. You heard from them? No, not yet. But we'll keep looking. It's Delta. You're breaking up. We're at the theater. Say again? You gotta get out of there, kid. They're letting the settlement go. Wait, can't we use the Hammer of Dawn? Not when I can't target the damn thing. Just fall back to the main gate. Baird, we're stuck on the other side of town. Phoenix, Lizzie here. You're at the theater? Lizzie, thank God. Affirmative. I've been diverted like six times. I can pick you up. Coming your way now. We'll be here. Delta out. In here, come on. Whoa, 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 what's this? We, uh, brought company.
Pops O'Dell. See any friendly faces you recognize? Maybe that's the uh, peaceful protester who broke my nose. You deserve worse than a broken nose. Why don't you show me what I deserve? Stop! Yeah, enough of this shit! You're a goddamn coward! A coward? Wow. Well, have I got news for you. Bart. Don't. Guess who ordered the first shot, Dell? Directly into those peaceful protesters of yours. Yeah, that's right. Lieutenant Pedigree there. Guys, come on, guys. I mean, they were throwing incendiary... The whole thing was confusing, all right? I, I didn't mean to have it happen. Never mind. Gather is here! Look, we can discuss this later. Come on. Shut it down! Shut it down! God damn it! Just run! 